Hello, you guys. <laughs> Today I got a package in the mail. Let me show you. And so now I'm going to uh, show you uh, what I got. Uh, I'm going to try to make this another relaxing type of video. So I hope I'm able to make a video that's relaxing to you. Let's see. The first thing we have is the gold frankincense and beer jelly. I don't know if you guys remember me telling you to uh, make sure and buy one if you get a chance because these are so, so good and so wonderful. This is not the best smell in the world. So a jelly that's full of beer and smells like cola bottles may sound like a dream but a whiff of its warming mandarin and star anise wobbliness will convince you it's real. It's got some gold luster in there as well. Wobble and lather or chill if you'd rather. Stroke over your body for a refreshing pint-sized pick-me-up. In a bit, I'll show you close up what it looks like. And then, yeah. And the next item is North Pole Soap. I can't wait to show you this. Here is a Midnight Massage Bar. And this is a, a Christmas item. Our Bling Crosby Bubble Bar in, made in the Karma Scent. And I'll show you that in a minute. Here's a Spice Mountain Soap. Mmm, it smells like red hot candies. It's so good. And here is a Christmas cake slice soap. Oh. Oh. Oh, you guys, remember that I don't know if you recall when I did my Lush Kitchen weekly previews, reviews video when uh, Lush was going to be making this. I told you that this was one of the very few Lush products that I haven't tried. And oh my God, just smelling it through the paper, I wish I would have gotten 10 of these. And then we have a Let Them Eat Cake lip balm. So we have two things with cake. We've got the Christmas cake slice and the let them eat cake. And then we have the egg snog lip balm. So we've got two lip balms there. Oh, my jingle spells bath bomb. I am so excited. Excited. I cannot wait to use this. As some of you know, this has been one of my favorite Lush Bombs since 2001 when I first tried it. And oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait to try that. I am so excited. Here, ooh, oh, it smells so good. Here is a Cinders bath bomb. Isn't that awesome? What's a little handwritten note there? It smells so good. Here is the gingerbread house bubble bar. Oh, it smells so good. Mm. Here is a Bombardino bath bomb. Oh, it smells so good. I have a demo and review video here on my YouTube of the Bombardino bath bomb. If you want to see what this looks like in the tub. Oh, Starlight Star Bright Bath Melt. Oh, you can smell it. Oh, I can smell that nice bright lime. Oh, that smells good. Here is a Want to Believe bath melt. I'd like to show you that. Cool. Here's, here's a sugar plum fairy scrub. Oh, 
And here is a melting snowman bath melt for Christmas. Here's an old blue skies shower gel. Gorgeous. Look how gorgeous this is. <gasps> the blue color is so pretty. So I'll be doing a demo of this and I'll be comparing it to the old, old blue skies is back shower gel as you guys had requested me to do. Glog shower gel. <laughs> Randy butter buttercream. Mmm, mm. it smells like something spicy for Christmas that you would eat for dessert. Randy buttercream. That's what it looks like. It looks so luscious and luxurious. Mmm. And then here is Lush Snow Showers Shower Jelly. And last but not least, Jilted Elf Shower Jelly. And I'll show you what that looks like. My pretty color. Mm. I'm so glad that Lush made Elf on the Shelf Fun Bar in this scent. Okay, and so that's everything in my order. And so now I'm gonna lay everything out and so we can see it all together. So here are the things in my uh, box from Lush. And so now I'm just gonna show them to you close up. So this one is, this one's the Spice Mountain soap. And right now it's smelling like cinnamon candies. I'll be doing a demo review video of that here and on my blog. Here is Melting Snow Matte Bath Melt. And this was made in the scent of Hot Toddy. And next is the Want to Believe Bath Melt. Here's the Want to Believe Bath Melt. And it's supposed to look like a lump of coal for Christmas. And um, because if you're bad, Santa will give you a lump of coal instead of a present. <laughs> and as you can see, it has lovely silver glitter on it. And Believe it or not, I don't have a demo video of this. I have uh, photos of this, so I'll be doing that. And next is Cinder's Bath Bomb. I noticed it's a handwritten label. That works. Here we go. As it's supposed to remind us of sitting by a fire on Christmas Eve, so logs that are popping and crackling. I have a perfume, a Cinder's perfume, I'll show you sometime. Okay, next we have the Bling Crosby Bubble Bar. And this one is made in the Lush Karma scent. Lovely. Can't wait. And next, North Pole Soap. Let me go take the glitter off of my hands here. This is Christmas Cake Slice. Opaque yellow piece on the top and 
kind of a almost a glycerin based bottom and I am so not joking when I say that in my opinion this is one of the best smelling soaps <laughs> lush soaps that I've ever smelled oh I think I'm addicted already okay so I'm going to read the label here it says it's got Lather up the spicy yet moorishly sweet vetiver, cedarwood, and almond oil mix to cleanse and gently soften the skin. It says coconut oil, cedarwood oil, almond oil, vetiver oil. It's suitable for vegans. I don't know. Uh, this just... Honestly, I can't believe this right now. And this was one... Of, if you watch my Lush Kitchen weekly preview videos you know that this was one of the very few lush products that i have not tried over the last 15 years and uh, i can't believe it because i think this is one of the best smelling soaps that i've ever smelled from lush honest to god wow wow okay and here we have Bombardino bath bomb. Now, all of these, if you couldn't tell already, all of these are lush Christmas items that were only available on the um, Lush Kitchen mail order website at lush.co.uk slash kitchen. Here is Bombardino. He has his little white cap on. And he, actually, he's supposed to look like a drink. Here's what the drink, it's an Italian uh, winter drink, looks like. And now you can see why it looks like it does. So it has the frothy whipped cream on the top. So. I have a demo and review of this here on my YouTube channel. I'll put the link in the description box below so you can see what it looks like up close in the tub. So, one of my favorite holiday items. And then we have Midnight Massage, Massage Bar. Open that up. a pretty 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 massage bar because it has gold in it mm. oh gosh here is sugar plum fairy sugar scrub and this one has orange flower alang alang jasmine vetiver and plum kernel oil and you can see the sugar plum fairy there Next, we have North Pole Soap. That's what it looks like. North Pole Soap. The pink part is a kind of sweet peppermint smell. And the white part smells more sort of woodsy and minty. A couple more things here. Here's the Starlight Star Bright Bath Melt, and this one has lime, coconut oil, lavender, and ginger. As you can see, what it looks like in the water, the glittery silver water. So that's Starlight Star Bright Bath Melt. And then here's the here's the Let Them Eat Cake lip balm. Top. Oh gosh. Mmm. Mm. It's got a cake smell for sure, but it's also got sort of like this kind of burnt caramel kind of a smell. It's made with the lemon peel, plum kernel, sherry cognac, um, lime, vanilla, uh, black treacle, glycerin, currant, sultana and raisin infusion, orange and lemon. Peel, shea butter, 
And here is the Egg Snog Lip Balm. In my nose's opinion, anyway, it doesn't smell as good as the Let Them Eat Cake Lip Balm, but it does smell rather good. And then last but not least is my beloved Balm Jingle Spells that I have loved since I started doing this in 2001. Here, swing. Yum. Oh my. And then we have the gold frankincense and beer jelly. You can see it has a lovely gold shimmer. The jilted elf jelly. And what it looks like. And then here is Old Blue Skies Shower Gel, Indie Butter, Buttercream, and it's just it's so nice. Good. Okay. Okay, and that is my Lush Christmas 2016 haul from the Lush Kitchen. I'll be taking lots of photos and demos of each one of these products and uploading them here to my YouTube channel and also uploading the photos onto my blog and the reviews and uh, photos on my Instagram as well. And if you have any questions, just comment down below and I will answer as soon as I can. If you enjoyed this video, please like my video by giving me a thumbs up down below and as always, thanks so much for watching, and we'll talk to you very soon on the next video.